So you made a resolution to lose weight and it's working, good, that's awesome, but what do you do with all those clothes that are now too big? We put that question to fashion stylist extraordinaire April Clark and she's here with some solutions along with model Crystalline Roberts. Ladies, thank you for yeah. being here. Thank you for having us and congratulations to Crystalline. Yes. <laughs> Tell us about her weight loss journey. Crystalline from May of last year to now has lost 35 pounds and 20 inches. Yes, congratulations. So in that, she is my client and we have gone shopping and you know dressed her for her old body. And so now she's like, okay, I'm not quite ready April, but I still need to keep what I have. What do I do? Yeah, and that's a big <laughs> question for everybody. Let's get to your tips starting with belts. Belts are your friend, Belts, you said. belts. 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 Big belts, small belts, skinny belts, all kinds <laughs> all of belts, 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 belts. Why? Because this was one of the dresses that we purchased for her when she was at her old weight. Okay. And so all we did was we took and we put a skinnier belt on. And as you can see, it was a little blousey right here, as you can see, blousey. Mm -hmm. But when we go ahead and we tuck that back here a okay. little bit, right? She has an and she has a waist. We can see her new waist. Yes, yeah, shows it off. Right. Now, for bigger belts, I always tell people that if you're gonna layer, you're going to use a bigger belt. Okay. Don't use a skinny belt because then it'll get lost and then it'll make you look really big. Okay. Right. So you a need lot, a full size belt. Exactly. A lot of times women like to cover up and they're saying, you know, that'll make, I'm trying to protect myself, but if you cover up, it makes you look bigger. Okay. So show some skin. Okay. So if she didn't have this belt on, we kept it on for just for this purpose. Okay. And we put a larger belt oh, on. And put a belt around the jacket. Around her jacket. Instantly gives her a waist. And it's a bigger jacket, but it kind of, Gives her a little waist right there. Okay, that so looks really nice. Without the without red, without the red like belt, we had it on because she has a mic on. We don't want the mic right, to drop. Right. But yes. yes. And that would kind of put the belt around the exactly. outside. Exactly. And so fashion forward, this belt kind of goes with the seam and the down. Absolutely. Yeah. And you want to make sure that you try different sizes for different types and different items, mm -hmm. not just one belt, one size, because a smaller belt on a bigger item can make you look bigger. Gotcha. Let's talk about DIY alterations. DIY alterations. There is this thing I love, love, love <laughs> called the hip hugger. Okay. And the hip hugger will make you smaller in your pants when they're bigger. Crystal we have a picture of it. Yes. Crystalyn said she has some pants that are bigger, but she's not sure she wants to alter them now. No, not that picture. Is well, that, that is actually the perfect the perfect button. Okay. And that's perfect <laughs> if you are gaining weight, but it's also great if you're losing weight because okay. you can put the button anywhere and it can Im immediately make your pants fit. Oh, right. Okay, this is the, that's the hip hugger. The hip hugger. And as you can see, the gap. You see the gap in her pants. Mm -hmm. That's a big thing. You know when you have. You know weight loss. Weight loss. But yeah. you don't want to get rid of great jeans. Yeah. So you take the hip hugger on a loop and then it instantly gives you a smaller waist. Wow, nice. that's cool, yes. the hip hugger. All right, yes. you suggest we thrift, swap, and sell. Now, Ab this is something that's hard for me to do, giving up stuff, Yes. but you say it's important. Absolutely, thrifting. Crystalline actually got a lot of her belts from, from the thrift store, and it's easy, it's quick, something that's affordable. Mm -hmm. You also want to try to swap. Find women who are bigger than you, smaller than you, and then you give away your bigger clothes and get some of their smaller clothes. Have a party. I've oh, heard of people having have swap, swap parties. Have a swap party, see? I told her about that. That's a real thing. <laughs> right. And then places like Clothes Mentor, you can go ahead and sell your old clothes, get the money, and buy new clothes. So then it helps you that you're not spending a lot of money mm -hmm. on clothes that you're not ready to commit to. I have done that, and that, let me say, I like when I get the money back. Yes. All right, finally, learn your new body. Right, so Crystalline and I, we have done lots of shopping for her old body. It costs nothing to go and try new clothes on. Right. It costs yes. nothing. <laughs> Just go try them on. nothing. You might like a way that a full skirt looked on your old body, but try an A-line skirt. Try something that's different. Mix it Le up. Right. Learn who you are now. These are great tips. Congratulations to you. Thank you for being here. Thank you, April. Thank yeah, you. Thank you. And thank